Hi guys and welcome to Tech Based. In this video, we're gonna do a little experiment and we're gonna see if we are able to install updates, Windows updates on a Windows 11 unsupported computer. Basically, I have here a machine that doesn't have secure boot or TPM enabled. And of course, I installed Windows 11 using one of those methods that I showed you in previous videos. If I open the PC Health Check app and check the minimum system requirements, you can see that this PC doesn't currently meet Windows 11 system requirements. It says that I don't have TPM 2.0 and it says that it supports secure, but, but uh, I don't have it enabled. So I think this is a little bit bugged on the PC Health Check app side, but that is no issue. Basically, this computer is not supported and uh, normally by using Windows updates, we should not be able to upgrade to Windows 11 on this machine. Let's see if we are able to install updates. So we're just going to open up the settings app and we're going to go into the Windows update section and let's see if we are able to install the latest security and also feature updates. Basically, if I'm not wrong, the latest build for the main version of Windows 11 is 22k.318. So let's go and download and see. Right now we are on the version 22 k.258 which is basically the iso version that we download from the microsoft website but let's see if we are able to install all the updates as you can see we have the cumulative update for windows 11 which is kb 507215 so this is good news we can install the cumulative updates and we also have the kb 508295 so i'm guessing that we are still able to install every update that is available on windows 11 in my opinion on a unsupported Windows 11 machine, you will be able to install any update that comes up in Windows Update, but I don't think you will be able to upgrade to a newer version of Windows 11 when it will come out. For So for example, if we have a new Windows 11 version coming at the end of next year, so 2022, maybe you won't be able to automatically upgrade using Windows Update, but you will have to do a third party script or clean install of Windows 11, which is not really a big problem because if we can install the security updates and all the fixes that come into these cumulative updates, I think Windows 11 is pretty much good for use even on a unsupported Windows 11 machine. So we're just going to wait for these updates to install and then we're going to come back to see if we are on the latest build and of course on the latest cumulative update. After the restart, if we're going to check the Windows version, you can see that we are on 22k.318, which is basically the latest build for for Windows 11, the main version. And also let's check for updates one more time to make sure that we don't have any updates left. And then we're gonna check the update history and we will see that all the updates will be installed there. And as you can see in update history, we have all the updates. We have the quality updates, which are the KB507215, which is the latest one. We have the driver updates and so on. So the answer is you can still install Windows updates, the quality, the security, the drivers updates, into a machine that doesn't support Windows 11 and of course has Windows 11 installed using some methods that I've showed you in previous videos. So for those of you who asked this question, I'm hoping that this video will help you understand better how Windows 11 works on unsupported machines. If the video is useful, don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.